All right, solving this problem, um, we want to break these down to their simplest components. So cosine of theta times sine over theta, cosine over theta for the tangent, and then cosine of theta times sine of theta is equal to one over sine theta, which is what the cosecant breaks down to. All right, so when we multiply cosine of theta times tangent, it crosses that out. So we just, we're left with sine plus cosine squared theta over sine theta is equal to one over sine theta. So if I do common denominators, if I multiply top and bottom sine, sine over sine for the left portion, I get sine squared theta plus cosine squared theta all over sine theta. Oops. It's equal to one over sine theta. So this becomes simply one and it's a trig identity, so we're simply left with one over sine theta equals one over sine theta. And that's it. Hope that helps you out. Thanks for watching.